Now we are doing exercise 1.2, question number 5, Roman number 5. What does question number 5 says is represent the following number on the number line. And question is Roman number 5, which is root over 29. I need to represent root over 29 on a number line. How to do that? Let us start. Solution. We can write We can write 29 is equal to How can you write 29? 29 I can write on as 25 plus 4 Why am I writing 25 plus 4? The reason is 25 I can write on as 5 square And 4 I can write on as 2 square I can write I can write other number Other number also can be written But Another number that I must write must be square number Okay That's good. like if it is 26, any number whose square is 26, no right, so I cannot write 26. So be very careful while you take this number. I'm taking 25 plus 4 and this this is the most easy one and most accurate one, okay. So this is the near number, so I'm taking this one. After that, you draw a line. I'm drawing a line, my line seems a little bit crooked. So, okay, I have it straight now. Now after that, let me mark the points so i hope you know how to mark the points like let me take the distance you can take a scale and do you can do it properly with your scale and this you can write on as minus one here zero here one two three 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and goes on like this. Now, the first number is 5 here and second number is 2 here. So first, you make 5. So how to make 5? From 0 till 5. From 0 till 5, you draw a line. From 0 till 5, you draw a single line. Okay? So after that, after that, after that, what you're going to do is, 5 is drawn, now take 2. 2, you're going to draw perpendicular here. Don't forget, you're going to draw 2 perpendicular here. Take 2 is the distance, so from 0 to 2, what is the distance you are taking before? You take that. So I can draw 2, I hope this is my distance 2. I hope I'm not mistaken, okay? Please be very careful while drawing this. Another thing you need to remember is, take protector and draw, okay? This angle must be 90 degree. So first you will take the protector, take 90 degree, mark the point, after that draw 2 cm. First you will mark 90 degree with your protector and after that you will draw the line. Okay, don't forget to do that. After that join these two lines. So if you join these two lines, let me take a straight line from here and here. Now from 0 to 5, the unit is how much? How much is the distance here? It is 5, right? And from 5 above this perpendicular one it is 2 this is 5 no let me name it name the triangle a b c so same thing i don't have the space even now so let me make it here but please don't do like me you write it down properly please write it down properly for me i have no space so i'm doing like this no i cannot make like this So I want to draw like this. Okay, fine. I'm much wasting much time on this. Now in triangle A, B, C, in triangle A, B, C, what you can do is you can write down A, C square. Using Pythagoras theorem in triangle A, B, C, you can write down A, C square is equal to A, B square plus B, C square. What is AB? AB is 5 units, right? 5 square plus BC is 2 square. 5 square is 25, 2 square is 4 and AC square. So AC square will come this side and it will become root. 25 plus 4, it is 29. Okay, so how much you got AC? AC you got to be root over 29. Okay, this much. Now since you got AC is equal to 29, you take A as the pin of your compass 
and V C is the pencil side of your compass and draw arc okay draw like circle type arc okay from this point you draw a arc like this so if you draw an arc let me check change the color so that it will look good so from here draw a arc okay your arc may look something like this i don't i don't i cannot draw exactly here because of my incapability I mean, because i cannot have the i don't have the instrument here you draw something like this you may your line may come something like this if it comes a little bit different so fine but you must understand the idea idea is like this you are going to take a in the pin side of your compass c is the pencil side of your compass and draw the line like this yeah in future if i get the option of doing that i'll do that okay and i'll upload the video again but for now i could not do that so i'm doing like this so now ap so ap ap and ac will be equal ap is equal to ac and ap and ac are equal ac is how much root over 29 so ac is root over 29 and ap is equal to root over 29 is represented is represented on the number line right is represented on the number line ap and ac are equal which is equal to root over 29 and you are representing this on the number line and ap is represented number this so that's done so you have represented i hope i hope you'll understand you got to understand the idea if in case you didn't understand please let me know in the comment below that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video